Try and keep up. 13, sir. 13. Because if you don't, $1,300 number, seven twenty seven twenty. You'll miss out. Selling the next one right here is a key up. On the more than 100 items sold at Saturday's Horry County Police Auction. Who get 25? Items that included cars, chainsaws, and believe it or not, a turkey fryer. Um, these have either been abandoned, stolen, recovered, um, and the owners just don't come for them. Insurance companies don't come for them. 400, four and a quarter. Money from the auction goes into the county's general fund. And past auctions have brought in more than $50,000. I see money. <laughs> but they've also brought highest bidders like Jimmy McCullough luck. We pay like $400 for this. It's probably more than over three, $4,000 worth of parts to sit right here. Yeah, just this. It's this one thing here alone here costs you four or five hundred dollars right here. And those dollars kept adding up. 625 number. 634. 634 here. For those looking ahead. I got to make a living somewhere. The way the economy is, every little penny helps in the long run. So if I could save on buying a car here versus buying it at a dealership, it's a great deal. And call it scraps, call it used parts. Just make sure you don't call it junk. No, 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 never. It might be junk to someone, but not to myself. Swing arm by itself right there. <laughs> I sell me $100. Cashing in on the opportunity. 625, 625. That others left behind. In Horry County, Ryan Nockan, News Channel 15.